and make them out of 100% recycled water bottles. And then we donate 10% of our profits to animal conservation programs. Mm -hmm. Like the polar bear, for example. There's over 4,000 different endangered species. We're the dominant species on our planet. It's basically our job to help. help. I'm Eco Evie and I'm 12 plus one. I'm just, a, I'm actually very sensitive about my age. Um, and I'm Kelly, Evie's mom, and I'm 39 plus one. We are from North America. We are from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. We take shirts and make them out of 100% recycled water bottles, but then pops up the question, how do you transform a water bottle into a shirt? And we have a process in including our demonstration models. So this is the process of the recycling. Um, water bottles get chopped up into little flakes. They're melted into these little pellets. And then it becomes this yarn. And it's I, I'm guessing that it's out sticking out of the bottle a little because texture. We like to show people this um, when we are in person. We do all the printing, cutting, and sewing of all of our garments in Milwaukee where we live. What we do is a digital printing process which allows us to not use any water in the dyeing process. We also feature different endangered animals on our shirts, and then we donate 10% of our profits to animal conservation programs. Like the polar bear, for example, and some of these have unique stories. Like I wanted to do a polar bear shirt. As well. She told me it had to have the Northern Lights on it yes. for, for our polar bears. And so we've been able to donate to organizations like Polar Bears International that is helping to survey uh, mom and baby polar bears, watching them, making sure that they are not being interfered with by humans, and also tracking them to make sure that they are able to get the food that they need and survive. So it's really important work and we're excited. We've donated to uh, probably two dozen organizations by now and Evie has donated over $1,800 and we have recycled over 35,000 water bottles so far. We're gonna show you a couple of our shirts. So this one here is our hippo. These are actually all different watercolor paintings that we're able to digitally print onto our shirt. Mm -hmm. So we started our women's line um, about two years ago, and then we started with some men's or unisex hoodies a year ago. And we're bringing out women's dresses soon. I'm very excited. With pockets. We all need pockets. Right. This business really, for both of us, kind of marries both of our passions. So we really wanted to make sure that we were building a truly green and truly sustainable company with her mission. We generally um, care a lot about our younger generations and because we're the dominant species on our planet, it's basically our job to help and not make life hard for these species that need our help in general. We have and to be better stewards of our earth. In fact, one Monday morning by 9 a.m., there were many endangered species that were declared officially extinct. And I think that with what we're trying to do, we're really seeing multi-generational excitement about the earth. And when you show someone, this is made from a 100% recycled product. It gives you hope for recycling and it makes you wanna do better. And that's what we really want. We want to inspire people. I have a bookmark that had a Native American proverb on it and it said, we do not inherit the world from our ancestors. We borrow it from our children. I sacrifice recess. I get all the work done in that period. Well, Evie is an avid reader. And so she very typically reads a lot at home and is coming up with all of the research on all these different animals. So her, her activism definitely shines uh, at school as well. We save the planet. There's literally nowhere else that it can sustain life. This is important. And, and we've got kids and we've got our kids' kids and more generations to come. So mm -hmm. we need to do our part. Mm -hmm. The earth has not done with its business yet. The earth gave us everything. And now here we are. We gotta take care of it. They call the earth mother nature for a reason. Mother earth. Don't be trash talking your mama. <laughs>